Hello friends of the Iowa Food and Family Project. I'm Kelsey Burns and I'm the food blogger and content creator over at dancearoundthekitchen.com. And today I'm sharing with you how to make a super easy and festive Valentine's Day breakfast board. I like to make sure I always have lots of different colors, lots of shapes and sizes. That way we're gonna have just a fun visual contrast on the board. Now we also wanna make sure we have a variety of textures and flavors when it comes to the foods that we're adding. So today with breakfast, we're gonna get it started more on the sweet side of things. And of course, being Valentine's Day, we're gonna add lots of heart-shaped items with this board. I actually have a little heart-shaped waffle maker and all I did was I tinted my waffle batter pink to create these adorable little heart-shaped waffles. So now with the waffles, we're also gonna add some syrup. We'll add that right over here. Next, we're gonna move into kind of the savory side of things. So when, when we're here in Iowa, I always think of eggs and pork because we are the number one pork producing state as well as the number one egg producing state. So what I did here to make it festive is I baked the sausage and the eggs each in their separate like nine by nine or eight by eight square pan. I pressed the sausage into the pan and I poured some eggs into another pan and I baked them each until they were cooked. And then I'm just gonna take these small cookie cutters and we're just gonna cut little hearts in there. So we've got kind of a bigger heart here for the eggs. We're just gonna kind of pile them up over here. We wanna make sure we're able to fit all of this stuff on our board. And then I did the same for the sausage. I made these a little bit smaller just for like I said, I like to add a variety of sizes. Now you gotta be careful because these are gonna be hot. These cute little heart sausages, and we're just gonna add those on the board as well. Do as many or as few as you would like. You can also think to add bacon or, um, there's lots of different options when it comes to breakfast. Ham, that would be another great one. So now that we've got our sausage and our eggs, we're gonna add something fresh and vibrant. So especially with being breakfast, we're gonna add some yogurt. Now, of course, we're gonna add some pink, um, and that is just strawberry yogurt. I'm also adding some vanilla yogurt, and then we're gonna add some fresh berries. So I have some blueberries here, then we're gonna add some strawberries. And like I said, I just like to pile these up. I like to be able to bring the board to the table, and everyone kind of can just graze together. It's nice because you don't have to get up and move to go get something off the counter. You have everything you need right here on the board in the center of your table. All right, so now that I've got, we've got our sweet item, we've got our savory sausage and eggs, and then we added our fresh yogurt and strawberries and blueberries. With it being Valentine's Day, we have to add some chocolate. So I'm adding a little container here of Nutella. And then I'm also gonna add some Valentine's Day M&Ms, just like I said, for a little more festive flair. So there we have it. This is a cute little Valentine's breakfast board that you can share with your families at home on Valentine's Day. I wish you the best Valentine's Day and we'll see you next time.